Hello Nightcap, uh, my name is Charlie and I'm uh, going to be doing some stand-up for you. Um, so I, uh, I write a lot and uh, I feel like I'm pretty good at it. Um, I had a major breakthrough uh, the other day. Um, I realized that uh, a lot is two words and not one. <laughs> and that gave me the space I needed. Um, I also knew I was performing tonight, and uh, and so I went and uh, searched for some bits for my set. <clears throat> I found them at Home Depot, um, and uh, I think that's going to help me uh, drill in my, my material. <laughs> okay, hang, in, uh, hang with me folks, it's only going to get worse from here. Um, <laughs> Speaking of getting worse, old people, <clears throat> they tend to get worse when they, well, people tend to get worse when they get old. Uh, so when I get old, I, I really like just someone to gouge my eyes out, and uh, here's why. I saw this old guy uh, walking down the uh, street a couple days ago, and he was hunched over using a walker on this crosswalk and just just going about as slow as you could possibly go. And um, <clears throat> and so I was thinking, I was, I was wondering, so, so this guy has a good eyesight. Uh, could you imagine just walking as slow as physically possible and then looking down and seeing an ant pass you? <laughs> and then the worst part about it would be if you saw the ant pass you, and you got angry, and then you went to stomp on it, and you were too slow, and the ant slipped past your foot, and you couldn't stomp on it. That's why I don't want to see any ants, and I just want to have my eyes gouged out. Uh, so, that's that. Um, I, I saw an ant trip the other day, <clears throat> I saw a snail sunbathing, uh, and it died shortly after. Uh, not from the sunbathing, from me pouring salt on it. Uh, yeah, don't do that. They don't. They don't survive that. Uh, I saw a jackass chuckle. That guy back there is jackass. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, speaking of jackasses. Uh, the number one jackass to me right now is, and I ranted about this a little bit last week, but uh, shitty customers. Shitty customers, they're right up there with like my worst, I just really hate them. Uh, and most of us deal with them. Uh, so I work at Belly's on the street, juice bar, pretty cool place, uh, check it out. But this customer, and I don't know what shitty customers do, I think they just find little nuggets, like they messed up once, you, you looked the wrong way or something, and they just... I find this little nugget and they just hold on, just hold on to it. And, uh, and they don't give it to you, they give it to your manager or the owner, like they go to the highest person they can go and they just put it all over the internet. Uh, but this, this one little nugget that this customer had uh, was that while she was munching away on popcorn and checking her phone, I uh, slipped outside to enjoy the you know, two fresh breaths of air uh, and then came back inside and that was a uh, Complain for I don't know how good your life has to be that that's a complaint. Um, I don't know if this person's read the news uh, lately. Uh, uh, the LA riot, uh, LA riot part two is going on in Missouri. Um, Palestine and Israel are in the cowboys and Indians. Guess who's who? Uh, and then in, uh, in, in Africa, you can't take a bite out of an apple or get stung by a mosquito without having some deadly disease. So, but on top of this person's list was somebody walking outside while they were eating popcorn. So, pretty, uh, pretty shitty person. Um, but I think what the reason why people get like this, you have to have like this like instant access. Have you? Has anyone experienced one-click shopping on Amazon? Yep. Uh, yeah, that's really uh, fucking awesome. Actually, that's a really cool fucking thing. I love one-click shopping on Amazon. Um, but you know what they should invent is one 
touch shopping. So if you're like walking down the aisle and you're like hungry and you see a bag of Cheetos, you just touch it and you bought it and then you can eat the Cheetos while you're while you're shopping. I mean that's like a great idea. <clears throat> Actually, little known fact, uh, God, uh, his first measure as leader of the universe was um, one touch shopping. <clears throat> Of course, Eve ruined that for everyone. <laughs> and, uh, and now he's filed into a hell, which I call modern-day capitalism, which allows fuckheads like this customer to demand instant access because if I don't demand it, fucking Amazon will! Woo! <laughs> Nobody else is excited about that. <clears throat> but there are more important things to get excited for or worry about. Uh, texting comes to mind for me. Um, so even if you're not a texter, I always thought I wasn't a texter. I always thought I was too cool for that. But if you start dating, especially if you're a guy who starts dating a girl, um, or whatever, the, you, you're going to start texting. Like That's just going to be a thing that you do like all the time. Like You're just going to just text. Like I, I'm dating someone, and that's really all. She sends like five texts, and I send one, and she sends five more, and it's just kind of ridiculous. But... But they definitely rope you in. So, so you'll send like a, you'll send like a, uh, hey, uh, you want to get together later, or are we still on for later tonight at seven? Something cute, you know. <laughs> you let that sit, and uh, you're just kind of home by yourself, just chilling. It's like in the afternoon sometime. Ten minutes pass, you're like, fuck, I don't think I have to text. I don't think I can text. 20 minutes go by, you're like checking your phone, you make sure that the volume's up all the way, take it off silence. You check to make sure you sent the text, you show somebody if they're there, like, yeah, I definitely sent the text. Uh, 30, 30, 40 minutes go by, you're, maybe, maybe they had to work tonight or today. Yeah, I'm pre no, I'm pretty sure they're not, maybe I could text them, no, I don't wanna do that. Uh, let's see here, start wearing some more. I think an hour goes by, you're like, fuck. It's fucking over. It's done. It's done. We're just not dating anymore, and that's just how it's going to be, and that just really sucks. I shouldn't have said the thing about her being a sex kitten. I mean, it's only been two dates. It's a dumb, stupid joke. You like, always like, question like everything you said. Like, fuck those. God damn it. Hour and a half goes by, you just fucking throw your phone across the room. You're like, fucking, fucking Verizon. They probably didn't fucking send it in the ether somewhere. I just. Yeah, I don't even like phones. I don't like dating. I hate dating. I hate people. I just hate people and phones and technology and this whole thing. Bing, bing, bing. Shit. Run over to the phone, collect it. Yes, yes, yes. She said yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank God. I love phones. I love people. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, 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 bing. Better than anything. Fucking stop texting! <laughs> That's my time. Thank you. I'm Charlie. <laughs>